welcome to forex success yeah i'm not gonna waste your time guys but i will just show you how to cast spike in this video let's just cast spike so right now make sure you hit that red subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you'll be notified each time i drop a new video give this video a thumbs up right now guys synthetic indices which are crash and booms which consist of crash and boom volatilities step in this jump in this and or jump in this rent breaker they are all found on there we've click on the link below to sign up and create an account to start trading guys crash 1000 in this is on a massive uptrend and what we want to do right now is that we want to catch a spike this is what we call a spike when the crash moves up it's spiked to the downside it is a spike yeah for crash it is a spike okay so now we want to catch this spike by placing a sell then when the spikes we find ourselves on profit then we take profit or we leave for more spike great so now how do we catch the spike is what we'll be dealing with today so first of all i'm going to clean all those indicators because we're not using them great i've cleaned the indicators guys so now this is what we need to do starting we don't want it to take much time we just move straight to the 30 minute time frame 30 minute time frame observe the market looking at for all support and resistance level guys we're going to catch spike on this video saying this the market moved yeah okay trying to check out previous chart patterns previous market patterns this is similar to what happened right here okay then it moves up so what we're gonna do is that we're gonna spot out all the resistance level yeah this is a resistant level at this point and this is a resistant level at this point so first of all without wasting time we're gonna place a cell right here at this point a three two four a three two four of course we're gonna place a cell right here at a three two four let's see i don't think there's funds in this account okay guys okay there's no funds in this account we're gonna be doing some transfer of this to this funds okay to this account so guys this is what you need i'll just show you the basics then i'll place the trade okay, let me place the trade on the web version let me place the trade on the web version good okay this is um crash 500 that i should some profits yeah so what i would do now guys is that i'm gonna place the trade right here the crash 1000 that we're about to sell so that we'll catch the spike i'm gonna place this trade the sell here crash 1000 in this yeah okay crash 1000 in this can see it here it's moving to the upside so what we're doing right now is that we don't care whether it is an uptrend or a downtrend we just want to catch that pullback of a market that pullback that happened right here exactly the same pullback that happened right here is what we want to catch right here again as a spike do you get that guys that is exactly what we want to catch again as a spike good so remember this is for success and hit the red subscribe button so we want to catch that pullback again at this point as a spike so what i'll be doing i'll be placing a cell cell good i just placed the cell on crash 1000 in this so now back to our mt5 meta trader 5 where we'll be observing the market so seeing now that this is a resistant level i told you we'll mark out all the resistance level let me take a 
this line and put it here serving as a resistance level you can see in fact this is a very strong it's a very strong resistant level guys look at it another one right here so it's a very strong resistance level so guys our stop loss will be when a candle closes above yeah when a candle closes above this red line do you get that guys so this zone right here is a resistance zone so if a candle closes above this red line above this zone which is probably above this the red line is 8333 you get that so if a candle closes above this 8333 it's a stop loss for us exactly move to the 15 minute time frame seeing the same you can see that guys so once a candle closes above this it is a stop loss but me i'm expecting it to spike before it gets there great so all we'll do with that we just have to wait for it to hit there to either give us the profit or it hit the stop loss either of them this is probability on trading great so guys while we wait i'll show you our crash and boom strategy which involves we need um the first indicator we need is the commodity channel index of course that we'll be using for the strategy is used to get perfect entry the period is 14 apply to typical price the levels 100 negative 100 as you can see done this is the commodity channel index right here on my screen then the next indicator on indicator window one is the market facilitation index the volume take it on tick levels mfi up mfi down just as you can see on my screen the green black black and green you click done you can see them put it on one minute great to okay so this is it zoom levels okay so we're done with that and um for the market facilitation index you can see it's on uptrend and the last indicator is the last one is the, the moving average which will um yeah so guys the last indicator sorry for the time the last indicator is the moving average moving average yeah period 21 shift zero method exponential apply to close make it red you click done you can see so this is our strategy how does this strategy work it's what we're waiting for as you can see based on our strategy guys it's indicating that crash 1000 will give us a sell why this is it where do we sell with this strategy we wait for the red moving average to cross above this green line at the overbought level which is above the 100 level it then gives us a spike you can see that so we're waiting for it to to give us a spike since the condition is met for it and considering the price action analysis we just took earlier guys guys we're getting the spike in no time so this is how the strategy works each time it crosses above you get a spike as far as the condition are met you can see it's happening when it crosses above it gets a spike it crosses above it gives us a spike it crosses above it gives us a spike this strategy is for the one minute time frame guys it happens in multiple places crosses above it gives us a spike great just like that perfect strategy it works for crash and boom okay for boom 1000 index for boom when the red moving average crosses below the green line at the oversold level you get a spike to the upside and again it happened here it gave us the spike happened here it gave us a spike you just need to be patient for the condition to be met again crosses below 
gives us the spike and again here the spike here again the spike again and again and again guys once condition is made you make the profit so remember we took the trade right here and it's still going up took the trade right there checking okay so what we're waiting for is for crash 1000 in this to spike guys remember we set we set the stop loss yeah 30 minutes yeah so we set the stop loss right here so our stop loss you can see please mark it out mark it out guys eight three 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 so once a candle closes above the eight three 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 it is a stop loss hit you get that guys once the price closes above the eight three 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 level then which means the stop loss has been hit so guys we we'll wait for the stop loss we we'll wait for the trade to move according to our prediction yo yo guys look at this look at it guys you can see the price started to move down for the crash 1000 index remember we took the trade look at it right here that's it crash 1000 to sell and then the price actually closed the candlestick actually closed above this uh resistance zone it actually closed above then it formed the doji which indicates a doji candle you can see that candle right there from the doji candle this one which actually indicates a reversal it indicates a reversal of course and then it sold you can see it sold so the resistance level actually worked look at it from the one hour time frame you see it here okay let me put it on the four hour time frame yeah guys from the four hour time frame from the four hour time frame you see that the candlestick hasn't closed above this resistant level so i'm seeing it that it's going to sell so that's why i'm still holding my position even from the 15 minute time frame that it closed above closed above it at the 15 minute time frame then it starts selling checking the 30 minute time frame closed above gave us a doji which indicates say guys i'm still holding on to this market because it's going to say so this is simply how you can trade crash and boom and see our uh, trade on profit of course so this is how you can trade crash and boom guys it works of course it works price action look at it look at the spike so sometimes the market want to deceive you want to play games with you but if you know what you're doing you just have to be patient and wait so check out the trade you can see it's on profit of five dollar right now look at the one minute time frame spikes of course the four hour time frame you can see so guys i'm holding on to this market to continue the downtrend of course so this is it guys like we said the i told you guys let me put it on 30 minutes and print this maybe i told you the resistance zone it affects the spike look at it so at the same just that this particular one took longer to to occur like this one guys look at this resistance zone came there and the spike and again for this it also spike i was showing you guys that this is a very strong resistant level seeing it that there is a resistant level here and here that is it is joining with this and this one guys look at it and then give us the spike at this point you see guys so this is it make sure you hit the red subscribe button guys and turn on the notification bell so if you don't know what we're trading this is synthetic and this is only found on there if the link is at the description below to open an account so that you can start trading all of them look at the jumping this volatilities and crash and boom step in this you won't find this on any other broker except there so click on the link to 
create an account and link it to your mt5 where you can start trading it guys you can also trade on your web just like i'm doing right now so i'm holding the trade guys thank you and make sure you turn on the red bell notification bell to keep the to to be notified when i drop a new video thank you guys forex success